welcome back to my channel i hope you are all doing well thank you to my new subscribers thank you to my ogs for coming back and yeah i love you guys thank you so today's video is going to be top 10 fragrances that i could use for life like i have loads of fragrances that i use for life but i literally just picked this top 10 um out of the bag because every single fragrance i own i absolutely love so but i'm gonna stick to this top 10 for the sake of this video so enjoy first fragrance is pink sugar by aquilina this is a very useful lovely fresh fragrance it is just it just smells like sugar and vanilla and cotton candy it has notes of oranges bergamot raspberry fig leaves cotton candy red berries licorice caramel vanilla musk and tonka beans it is like a it's quite a universal type of fragrance i don't think anybody would not like this it's just a very sweet not very it, it's sweet and just fresh and i don't know a happy fragrance like this fragrance makes me think of happiness because it's just so uplifting and i love it so once again that is pink sugar by aquilina the next fragrance is dior addicts this fragrance i've wanted to buy it for so long but my best friend decided to shut me up and finally buy it for me because i keep saying i really want to buy this fragrance well, I never bought it, so she surprised me and bought it for me. So thank you, babe. So this fragrance is really, really long lasting. It literally smells like, it literally smells like a jasmine and vanilla fragrance. It's like an OG fragrance, but it's timeless. It's very, very charming and it's quite seductive. It's just, it's very it melts in the skin really nicely i think you can wear it from day to night and it's just great it's great it's it's fabulous it's really really long lasting i think anybody um from any age range can really wear it because of its freshness and i feel like vanilla fragrances are quite um pleasing and unless you really really don't like vanilla you might not like this but it's vanilla that's done really really well and it's got jasmine in it and it's just great so yeah i absolutely adore this fragrance it's christian dior and it's addict dior addict the next fragrance is tom ford noir extreme this is like a it's like a woody oriental fragrance it's men's fragrance but I prefer it to the um, normal Tom Ford Noir for women. This is just a lot more long lasting. It's got a bit more character to it. And I find it really, really long lasting. And I find it quite pleasing to the nose. Like, I just love it. And it has notes of mandarin, roly, saffron, nutmeg, cardamom, um, rose, jasmine, orange blossom amber sandalwood and vanilla it's a great all-round fragrance for men and for women i think women i would actually say buy this if you're a woman rather than the um, original one for women which is the tom ford um, noir so yeah once again this is tom ford noir extreme next fragrance is ysl cinema this is one of my og fragrances that i've been using since i was in college this fragrance never lets me down it's an all-rounder it's an all-season all-day everyday type of fragrance it smells like a vanilla patchouli type of fragrance the patchouli is not too much um, it's quite subtle in this um, fragrance and it has notes of vanilla musk benzoin amber peony jasmine almond blossom clementine and it's just a fruity oriental fresh and sweet and kind of spicy sort of fragrance and like i said it's an all day all night anytime um sort of fragrance and yeah it's very very long lasting and 
I've never ever not not have this fragrance. I always when I run out before I even run out, I have to buy a new one. That's how much I love it. And yeah, it's um, YSL Cinema. The next fragrance is Insolence by Guerlain. This is one of my favorite fragrances ever. It reminds me of love because this was what I was wearing when I met my husband. I'm just in love. I've always been in love with these fragrances. Right now, I feel sick because of all the fragrances that are just, just hitting my nose. And um, yeah, so this is a very potent and fruity and floral fragrance. It is quite super long lasting. It has notes of raspberry, lemon, bergamot, violet, rose, iris, musk and tonka beans. And you can smell all of this in one and it's just so well put together fragrance. It's great for day to night. Most of my fragrances I can wear from day to night. I don't like to wear certain fragrances just for the day and one for the night. Like who's got time for that? I would just buy a fragrance that I like to smell on myself throughout the day. It doesn't really matter, you know, yeah, to me. So once again, this is um, Insolence by Guerlain. This is an eau de toilette, but it's very, very long lasting. You'd get at least six hours of this without any top off. It's such a great fragrance. I love the packaging, like everything about it. I just love, I really love. The next fragrance is one of my loves <laughs> and this is called Ambre Nui by Christian Dior. This, you can see this fragrance. Funny enough, I've had this for nearly two years and uh, it's really, this has lasted so long because I use this at least twice a week or even more. This is like, this is my go-to fragrance for everything. It is, where's my fan? There's my fan. This has like, like I just smelled like Turkish rose and it smells really elegant. It's like a one of a kind fragrance. It's unisex, but I think it leans towards um, the feminine side. This is an all day, all night fragrance. You spray, spray two on your neck, on your clothes. That's all you need for the rest of the day till the following day. It still keeps going. It can be worn by anyone who likes to feel sophisticated, expensive, elegant, and just incredible. So yeah, this is once again, Ambre Nui by Christian Dior. Next fragrance is Thierry Mugla Alien Essence Absolute. I think this fragrance is going to feature in every single video that I make going forward. I just love it. It is such a unique and mystical, mysterious and warm kind of fragrance. It is much better than the original um, um, Alien because it's not as, I don't know, it's not as, because that can be slightly offensive just because it's really, really strong. And this is just more subtle and it's, it just lasts really long. And like I said, with all these fragrances, it will last every fragrance that i own would be fine for you to wear morning till night and you can wear this to work you can wear it to a party you can you can wear it to anywhere i just wouldn't wear it to the gym just because it's a bit much for the gym i will get like a cheaper fragrance to wear to the gym actually i'm gonna do a top five video of fragrances that i wear to the gym is usually my most affordable fragrances that i wear to the gym so maybe after this video that will be the next one that i'll do so yeah alien essence absolute is definitely a wardrobe staple must have fragrance fantastic the next fragrance is called hypnotic poison by christian dior this is one fine fragrance it makes me feel like a fine fine babe that's what i get with this mm. it's like a nutty almond and vanilla like fragrance it is so long lasting it is kind of like sweet and fresh and like i said it's a bit nutty and it has notes of apricot plum coconut tuberose jasmine lily of the valley rose brazilian rose wood um, base notes of sandalwood, almond, vanilla and musk 
and that's what you get you get a vanilla musky nutty fragrance it is very very feminine very womanly and i find it quite sexy like i think a lot of men seems to gra gravitate towards this fragrance like when i put it on my husband is like hmm, what's that like it always catches your attention and it is really really long lasting for an eau de toilette i don't like the perfume version it stinks funny to me it smells funny let me not say stinks but it just doesn't smell it smells weird to me maybe it's just my nose so yeah it's hypnotic poison by christian dior the next fragrance is called changing constant by ken halligans if you guys have like watched any of my videos i mentioned this in at least one or two videos it is just it's like a um what's the word it's a, like a magnificent fragrance it is just so spot on and it brings me joy this fragrance does and i find this to be so unique in many ways it has just simple notes of cardamom pimento salted butter caramel tobacco accord vanilla and cashmere it is such a salty warm vanilla sweet fresh sexy all day all night fragrance it just stands out from the rest it is for any age i think probably from like early 20s to 100 <laughs> you know it's it's so lovely i went um fragrance shopping the other day with my mom and we smelled so many fragrances but she kept coming back to this one and she was just like no is this one this is special like my mom loves it my best friend loves it like my husband everybody loves this fragrance and it's the best it's like a fragrance you can buy blindly you wouldn't like go and buy it trust me trust me on this one trust me so once again this is pen halligans and it's called changing constant this next fragrance is a fragrance for life it is perfection in a bottle it is happiness in a bottle it is sexiness in a bottle it is the one and only mason francis Cook de jeanne bracara rouge 540 such a mouthful like each time i literally have to like stop to get the um, pronunciation correctly but if i haven't got it correctly i'm sorry but it is what it is this fragrance has so many dupes out there but nothing compares to it like the other fragrances like the um the ariana grande cloud and the paco raban dangerous they both smell quite similar but they're similar they're not the real deal so I don't want to spray this fragrance guys because it's expensive so i'm just gonna sniff from the bottle instead this is the best fragrance ever made in my opinion you don't have to agree it's my opinion it's how the fragrance makes me feel when i put it on and it's the longevity of this fragrance and the uniqueness of it obviously a lot of people have it like a lot of people i know do have it now but it still doesn't take away its uniqueness it has notes of where are the notes ah notes of jasmine saffron amberwood ambergris resin and cedar this is just a woody warm and spicy fragrance it's aromatic it's the best like there's nothing else i can say to quantify the greatness of this fragrance it is definitely worth saving up for because it is quite pricey it's really pricey for this tiny bottle but really and truly this tiny bottle will last you a very very long time because you need two sprays to last you for days not one day for days yes it's that long lasting so that is Bacara Rouge 540 so that brings me to the end of this video of my top 10 lifelong forever and ever fragrances i hope you guys have enjoyed it let me know what is your like all-time favorite must have lifetime kind of fragrance let me know down below i really i'm really um, interested so yeah that's it for this video don't forget to comment 
like and subscribe and i'll see you in my next one bye guys thank you for watching bye